For any question from the get-go, no, no culinary culture uh, elevates, takes the food as seriously. No, nowhere else, some sushi chefs I'm well aware, were, are only allowed to work on rice for seven years before they're even allowed to touch fish. Uh, nobody fetishizes food, uh, the, the, the simple perfection, the glory of the ingredient. Nobody, I, no other culture I've ever experienced are still, when you find a sushi chef uh, at age 75 who's been doing the same 25, 30 cuts of Edo style, old school, same cuts of sushi, still struggling every night to, to, to make what he's been doing a million times just a little bit better, still striving for perfection. That attitude is irreplaceable, coupled with no, no cuisine in, in America is both so popular and at the same time so terribly misunderstood. Anytime you hear anyone say, oh, that sushi, it was so fresh. The fish was so fresh. They completely missed the point already. Um, the best sushi is not the freshest sushi. Sushi is about the rice as much as it's about the fish. So all of those things, which you can tell already, I clearly feel strongly about it. <laughs> so there was never any, any doubt. That, that okay. And another question. Is your main character going to be traveling like what you did in your you know, shows? Oh, you mean will we move? Will we continue with this? Yes. Well, I'd love to. You know. <laughs>